Hello dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting further, I would like to say something. Please watch video completely. Sit with copy pane. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed further. Although you have facing any problem or difficulties, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you. Now here is the question. A boy of mass 4 kg is standing on a piece of wood having mass 5 kg. If the coefficient of friction between the wood and the floor is 0 0.5, maximum force that the boy can exert on the rope so that the piece of wood does not move from its place is fill in the blanks in Newton. Uh, in Newton. And uh, G can be kept here 10 meter per second, mu is given 0 0.5. Now according to the free body diagram, here the boy standing on this wooden piece and its weight is 5 kg and the weight of this boy is 4 kg. Here the normal force is acting upward direction and this uh, boy is also applying some force and tension force is also in the direction of upward. So here N plus T is equal to total weight 5 plus 4 is 9 and uh, G, G is 10. Then N plus T equal to 90. Then normal force N equal to 90 minus T, it is the first equation. When the for second condition, when this uh, block is moving towards to the right side, means tension is applied here. So tension force equal to mu and normal force. And what is normal force? Normal force is 90 minus t okay now substitute this value t equal to and uh, what is the value of mu mu is given 0 0.5 and uh, 90 minus t 0 0.5 can be written as 1 by 2 okay 2t equal to 90 minus t then uh, transposing this minus t to the left side become positive plus t equal to 90 then 2t plus t is 3t equal to 90 then t equal to 90 by 3 means 30 newton so here 30 newton when applying then body doesn't move so i hope so you understood this uh, situation